Where are you, sick baby? Oh, you you missed because you're a baby and you're a loser. You're a loser, baby. Lesser babies have beaten me before, Leviathan. I don't practice Santeria. I ain't got no crystal ball. But it had it, but it had it, but I... Uh. I spent it all! Hi everybody! Welcome, welcome to Final Fantasy 16. We are heading back to the wonderful, wonderful world of Valisthea, right? Where we are going to see one man reunite with his lover. The long lost love of his life. Mott Mott Games and Joshua Rossfield. Finally, it is a love story of the ages. Did you know, actually, fun fact, that William Shakespeare back in the 16th century, I believe, um, actually predicted the story of Joshua Rossfield and myself um, in, his, in his little short play, you might have heard of it, a little something called Romeo and Juliet. He was actually writing about me and Joshua Rossfield, star-crossed lovers. One is a man living in Atlanta and the other is a 2D character. And then when Joshua dies, then I too will die. In case y'all weren't here for the for the playthrough of that, this is what the lore board looks like at the very end. So, 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 what do I know before beginning this DLC? What do I know? I know uh, very, very little things, very little things. I know that Leviathan's in it. Um, according to something, I don't remember where, uh, this does take place in the Northlands, which is where Shiva and the tribe that comes up with Shiva is from. And, hey, spoiler alert, it has something to do with Shiva as well. I'm excited. Y'all are all excited. Let's get into it. Oh, buddy, look at him. Oh, oh, Torgal! Torgi! Oh, my God. Ah! Jill! Joshua. Joshua, it's you. Do you remember me, Joshua? It's me. It's me, Joshy. You know who's at the hideout? <laughs> we have Dion Lesage at the hideout. Hey! The hour fast approaches. I, I love you. Oh my god, I love you. But of course, Defo Nod, of course. Of course, Joshua Rossfield and D Dion Lesage are going to be in the Boyfriend of the Nominee thing. Hey, hey! Chroniclers of the Fallen. Ooh, ooh! Uh, the way he spoke just like made my insides turn. Imagine it. I am imagining many things with you, Joshua Rossfield. It may yet end with us. Mm hmm. Yes, it will end with us. <laughs> Falling in love, getting married, having children, and and and, and uh, blissful domesticity, Joshua. Can you imagine it? We played 16 before we started playing the 8-bit games. So now it's like cool to know like where some of these are from. So Buster Sword, yep, yep, Buster Sword. The Onion Sword is from 3, which is really cool. Now when am I gonna get Cosa del Sol outfits for the Rossfield brothers? That's all I wanna know. Please let me put Joshua Rossfield in Tifa's cowboy outfit. Please, Square. Cortana, is that from somewhere? Oh, is it for 14? Interesting. Thank you, Lennox. I've never played 14. Sid, I shall not waste time mincing words. Leviathan's dominant is in need of rescue. And despite my innumerable misgivings about joining hands with the outlaw of the highest disrespute, the dame has assured me that there is none better suited to the task at hand. Inquire with one Layla. She will surely see you satisfied. Wait, Layla is the name of, um... The pirate, the pirate in two, two, two. Why, what now? Oh, hey, why are you, you, you were just hanging out my, were you just hiding under my bed? All right, then. Rouse Joshua and meet me in the mess. Yeah, I'll rouse Joshua. I'll rouse Joshua. I'll, I'll, uh, no, uh, uh, <coughs> sorry, cough. I know it can be a few years before a new dominance born. Oh, really? I didn't know that. I thought, like, once one dies, the other one's like... You know how, like, the in um, Avatar, when one Avatar dies, like, at the same time, someone somewhere else is being born, and that person's, like, the reincarnation of the Avatar? I thought that's kind of, like, what happens. <laughs> Every nation in the realm has lost its dominant. If word gets out that there is still one to be heard, they will stop at nothing to claim it for their own. Hey, whose fault is that? 
<laughs> oh my god, all you have to do is look at me that way and I'm blushing and I'm giggling. Oh, hey. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Joshua. Hey, Joshi. Oh my god, you're so hot. Okay. Hold on. I'd like that, but the Duke, he... Look at these two homosexuals. Look at these two homosexuals. Look at this male courtesan propositioning this man to join him at the Vale. I love, I love. I'm looking for a Layla. Whoa! Is this Trisha Paytas? So, will your friends be joining in? Or just... Oh! That's my brother! Jill can come. A location. North of town, on the shore of Isla Feist Bay. Isla Feist. There you'll find a tent, and the woman who can answer your questions. She kind of serves. She kind of serves. Hold on, look at her. Look at her. She's like, she's, she's giving, you know what I mean? She looks like, um, Hayden Panettiere? Is that how you say her name? Hayden Panettiere? I shall, I shall slay the mighty beasts. Everyone else think it's strange that this woman should prefer to keep to the outskirts of town. Not if she realizes the value of the information she's party to. And the danger it puts her in. Yeah, Joshua. Have you never propositioned a, a, a courtesan before? Jeez. Didn't know we were, we were uh, hanging out with a novice here. Didn't know we were hanging out with a virgin here. Wait, I want Ambrosia. I want Ambrosia out here. I want to compare the Chocobo mechanics here and um, in Rebirth. The Chocobo handling in this game is a little easier to grasp. <gasps> Was that there before? Was this Mother Crystal all the way there before? There's no way. There's no way that Mother Crystal was there before and like J Clive and Sid just like never took it into account. And this is like the scene in um the embers are still warm. So you're Sid. Lord of the Rings where Aragorn's like tracking Merry and Pippin. Hello. Ooh, hello. You're the one in the DLC. Oh, do you carry an axe? That's sick. Apologies. I <gasps> I did not mean to scream that loud. I did not mean to scream that loud. Shula from Missidia! Missidia! <laughs> Missidia was a prominent town in both Final Fantasy 2 and in 4. The very tribe into which it was believed Leviathan's Dominant was born. A people notable for their sapphire eyes and ivory hair. <gasps> oh! Like Xehanort. Despite the best efforts of both church and state, we are still very much alive. Oh, Sandbreak? Sandbreak is their Baron, dude, from 4. Did he have silver eyes? Only that it's been there a long time. The Surge. So Drake's eye was the Mother Crystal of the Northlands, and so the Surge came about when it was destroyed. The wave was raised by Leviathan in an act of rage, moments before the waters were stayed. And the icon and its dominant bound within. Oh, oh, oh! I'm guessing it's not Terence then. I hope that the dominant of Leviathan is hot. What did he do? He committed the greatest crime one of his kind. Oh, you're a racist. He was born. Oh no. You're, I forgot that people who are dominants and bearers are treated poorly. But he deserves a better fate than the one map. Oh, maybe you're not a racist. He deserves to be free. Never mind. Not a racist. Wow! No racism. God, your axe is so sick. Can I like touch it? Sandbrakwa. Sandbrak. Sandbrak. This is the this is the archipelago of the Iron Kingdom. This is Rosaria with its uh with 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 with, with its capital. Oh my God, y'all! I can geek out about Final Fantasy 16 all day, every day. I love 16's lore. I go cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs about uh. Uh, 16's lore. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. I don't see any wall. Of course you don't. That's the point. Oh. It's glamour woven by our ancestors to keep our village hidden from prying eyes. Like Wakanda. Watch. Oh my God! It is like Wakanda. <sighs> Wakanda forever. <sighs> That was Ooh, CG? Less than a slug of Bacchus wine. Bacchus. Clive. Oh, look at the CG. CG. It's blue, but how is that possible? 
you do know what a glamour is, don't you? Ours oh. just happens to work both ways, and a good thing too. I wouldn't fancy staring at those sickly clouds every day. Wow! Oh my god! <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Oh my god. Thank you for the hydrate. <laughs> I'm so excited! You look so you look so good here, Clivifer. So handsome, so handsome. You're a handsome young man. I want a handsome young man. Oh, look at him helping his little lady out. I I will be on I I will be honest. I am so in to um to Clive and Jill. I think they're such a good couple. Their chemistry is excellent. See, I feel like I like the childhood to um, lover, childhood friends to lover story with them. I'm not, I wasn't too keen on it with Cloud and Tifa, if I'm being honest. Drive. Homecoming? Hey, shout out to Rebirth. This isn't death, it's a homecoming. And please, call me Clive. Sid is an alias. Oh. You'll be pleased to learn, Lady Shula, that I have no such aliases. <laughs> So, Lord Margrace. Yeah, true. I miss Ben Starr's voice. There was this one um, interview that Ben Starr was doing that I thought was so interesting, where I think someone asked him who his video game crush is, and, he, <laughs> and then he went, "It'd be easy to tell you who isn't my video game crush." Yeah, the Ben Starr interviews are so good. But the one I think what he said was so interesting. They asked him who his video game crush was, and he said that it was. Uh, Rinwa from Final Fantasy VIII, and the other one was somebody from, I think, Yakuza? I think that's where he was from. I've always kind of was in love a little bit with Renoa from Final Fantasy VIII. Ichiban Kasuga. But I didn't know that Ben Starr was... I don't know if he was just making a fib or something, but I didn't know that Ben Starr was... was into the gents. I didn't know that I had a chance. <laughs> I don't have a chance. But, I like to think that I do. I... Adore Ben Starr with all my heart. I adore Ben Starr. I can't wait to see what else he does. I can't wait to see what other um, things he does. Welcome, my friends. Missidia! Oh my god, Missidia! Wow! Missidia has usually been like a home of like sorcerers and like wizards and stuff. Wow! Oh, wow! It's been a long time since I saw the North looking so... so... Alive. Miss Idia. Yeah, Jill's from the North. Jill's from the North, but... Um, she became a ward of the Rosarian House after uh, the Rosarian Conquest. I don't remember if it was Elwyn or if it was Elwyn's father who conquered the Northlands, but I remember, like, she became the ward after that. That's one of the cairns which maintain the glamour. Oh. <laughs> Me walks right up to it. Whoa. I wonder if they're maintaining it with that. Search was an act of rage. One wonders Whoa. what Whoa. This is honestly what I imagine, um, the... Like the lands around Alexandria look like in Final Fantasy IX. Like I can imagine myself like flying in the airship around here, um, fighting the black waltzes in the air. I cannot believe that it took Dion an entire uh, an entire seismic ability, and you know a gargantuan amount of effort to summon the the Zeta Flare. What only took Donald Duck. Just a, just a wave of his hand. It is still true that Donald Duck is the most powerful being in the Square Enix universe. Donald Duck is Thanos. I'm telling y'all, like, if Donald wanted to, he could have snapped his fingers and Xehanort, poof. Heartless, poof. Maleficent, poof. Gone. Gone, gone, gone. But you know why he didn't? Because he loves to watch Sora and Goofy suffer. The tributary is home! You said those syllables in a really weird accent. <laughs> Golly gee. Look at the size of that dog. Hey. Right, now, that's only Joshua. 
This is quite extraordinary. Like stepping into another world. I'll take you to many worlds, my love. I can show you the world. The moats of water long called oh. of Southern Ash their home. Until Drake's Horn fell and the Blight forced them ever inland where- Drake's Horn? Hey, isn't that what we saw on Twitter? Drake's Horn? Isn't that what we saw on Twitter? Joshua, where do you want to go first? The museum? Do you want to go to the- Do you want to go to the Mesidian amusement park first? Where do you want to go first? I'm excited to meet your village elder. Or I wonder if Polom or Polrom is in here. Ola. That's Walud for hello. This man, Walius. Is he Leviathan's dominant? That's right. No. Oh. So he's no man. Walius is still a baby. Oh, I'm going to be killing a baby? <laughs> Give me. But you said that the dominant and his icon were bound in such a hundred year old baby ago. That would surely make him older still. It would, if he'd been allowed to age. But the spell robbed the poor bairn of even that. Oh, like the avatar. Like Aang. I'm killing a baby. That's not this is that is not the twenty dollar experience that I thought I was going to be getting. Oh, what kind of crops do you grow? Cabbage? What is this? Weed? Y'all grow, uh, y'all grow that ganja here? Love it, love it. So that's the secret to your magic. Wait, are these baby, are these the baby chocobos of, um, 16? Are these the baby chocobos of 16? They are! I thought y'all were just chickens. Interesting. <laughs> these do not like, <laughs> these do not look like that rebirth, that rebirth chicken with the <laughs> gourd on its <laughs> Oh, is this a sacred pool? Oh, I was gonna jump into it and be disrespectful. Shula, how did these ships come to be here? What do you imagine happens when an icon of war- Oh, he like sent them flying over here. Did you have to ask? <laughs> Joshua, so sassy. Oh, sassy pants, Mr. Joshua. <gasps> Hello. <laughs> Heidi ho! <laughs> Hey, <laughs> Krakatoa, dude. Oh my god. Mr. Tonberries, Mr. Tonberries. Stay down. Stay down. Oh no. Chef's, no chef's knife, just regular. Oh my god, go on. Oh. I should have known. I should have known. I've gone through enough Final Fantasy uh, Final Fantasy games to know what a Tonberry does. But I was but I was hubristic, if you will. Look at her. It looks like the um that really famous Japanese painting of the waves. It's interesting to me because like as we get closer, it doesn't look like it's frozen. It almost looks like it's just water that's like paused, you know what I mean? So it is not frozen. It's like, it's literally just water that's not moving. Not gonna lie, so far, liking this DLC a lot more than I did um, the first one. Also, since this is just a glamour, I wonder if these are actually like blighted lands, you know what I mean? But that wouldn't make sense, because if these were just blighted lands, then we wouldn't be able to use our spells and stuff. Look at all the droplets of water suspended. Yeah. See, Joshua and I are amazed by the same things. Time for 80 summers. It's... It's not right. No. It's not. This is so cool. Bro, look at it! This, like, literal frozen wave. Wow, wow, wow. Like, I want to just, like, reach out and touch it. Like, I want to touch one of these, like, there. things. Up ahead. Okay. It's beautiful and scary. Absolutely. It's like, um, if y'all have ever heard the term laminar flow, it's like when, um, when water is flowing out of, like, a, a small opening, and it looks like water, like, it isn't, like, it's just frozen in midair. Um, it's like an, it's like an, uh, uh, an optical illusion, if you will. So that's what it kind of reminds me of, that laminar flow. All right. Oh, no, it's like a baby baby. <laughs> it's a baby baby. You want me to kill this baby baby? 
forget my first priming. The fear. I also remember Clive's first prime. Hey, that was terrifying. You want me to kill this baby? Then I'll ease his burden. No! <laughs> I'm not going to hurt him. Dang. Contrary to the tales, I don't go around killing dominance for no reason. They're actually all alive. There was a way to remove Wallace's icon. Wait. That's not exactly true, though. That's not exactly true, though, Clive. Because I can remove his icon, but you didn't necessarily remove their icons. You know what I mean? Like, Bahamut is still, like, there's still Bahamut inside of um, Dion. You know what I mean? And Shiva's still inside of um, Jill, supposedly. So it's not, it's not exactly true. He isn't without his risks. Okay, there we go. Sorry, I should have just let him talk. The icon remains no matter what. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Summons Ifrit. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Water balloons, please. Please. Is it done? Ah. New icon. New icon. I can. Feel the icon inside me. And the wolf is inside of me. Hello. Oh. <laughs> oh, one of the Chiradas? Like, uh. Oh, we get to fight with you? Power of water. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Serpent's cry. Oh. Oh. Triangle. Dude, I get the prompto guns. <laughs> I, turned, I turned 16 to a first person shooter. Oh my god. Crosswell? Oh! I kind of- I'm actually really excited to replay. Hopefully I get to keep this thing and fight Ultima with it. That'd be so sick. Water wall? No thanks. Oh man, I wish I could like- I forgot how like little I can like really do anything with Joshua and Jill. It's actually- it's crazy how like little there is for them to do. Clive, before, I feel like this is a fight that we should have had uh, Ifrit on. Also, when I replay this game on hard mode, I want to try like going outside of my my usual build. Maybe I might enjoy something else. There's more to this tale. It would be better if I explained back at the village. Can, can you not explain it now? Oh, girly pop, I really don't want to hurt this baby. <laughs> Girly Pop, uh, Elder Shula, I say this with love and peace and joy and honesty. I have no desire to hurt a baby. Hey, hot take, but I don't like hurting children. Is it? Does it hurt? <laughs> you want to see my Leviathan? <laughs> Probably if the seal is removed, the wave comes crashing down. And you know what, Defo Not? You know what? When that happens, it's gonna be the coolest thing ever. Although the last time a wave did come crashing down onto Clive and Jill, they ended up both naked on the beach somehow. Don't know how that happened. Don't know how that happened. Didn't make the connection in the beginning. I was like, why are your clothes off all of a sudden? Weren't we just talking to Odin? But now why are we naked? How did that happen? Hopefully, we can keep on our clothes this time. Hopefully, our clothes don't magically like wash away from our bodies when that happens. This is such a <laughs> look at this baby just like trapped in here with a snake. A few who did fled north and west, and in doing so discovered two things that would forever shape our fates. The first was an old legend revealing how to make your very own mother crystal. And we did that. We did that DLC. Oh, interesting. Oh, that is really interesting. The same people that, um, hold on. The same people where Famiel is from, these guys have these had the same origin. Famiel, like Famiel's people who built the Sage Spire during Echoes of the Fallen are from the same people that fled Ash all those years ago. Very interesting. When our ancestors first arrived, the land was uninhabited, save for an old witch who lived on the highest- A witch! As punishment for her failure, the thane- Look at her- look at the bottom of this witch's face. Doesn't that look like Jill's? Then we shall go prepared for a fight. Others? That said, it may be best if one of us stays behind. No, 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 no! Jill, 
direction. You're on staying here duty. Then I shall stay. No! safe, tributary. You have my thanks. <laughs> no! I'm re-deleting this game. <laughs> no! Josh, Joshua, no! Joshua, please, please reconsider. Ah, shucks. Although I am excited to see how, um, if there is some sort of connection between um, Jillifer and the the good folks over in um, of the witch. The witch. The witch is a cool thing. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm vibing. Wasn't there a witch in Final Fantasy 15? There's like a witch's cabin. Joshua, why, Joshua? Por qué, Joshua? Por qué? Por qué me odia, Joshua? Por qué? Tú eres la luz de mi vida. Well, I was wrong on a bunch of counts. I said hopefully the dominant of Leviathan was hot. Turns out it's a baby. This is like Gungaga. Me, Gungaga. Watch, they're gonna make me pick some mushrooms for for some some soup, some Mycidian soup. Whoa! Waterfalls, jungle, this is so cool. This looks like a, like so photorealistic, you know what I mean? This looks like something that you would, um, like you would go to, um, the Amazon, Amazon jungle, and you would find something like this, you know what I mean? And you'd like, take a picture, and this, it would look like this. But like, in Rebirth, there was something cartoony about the um, the settings, right? Cartoony might not be the right word. It's a little bit more stylized. Um, but this, I think they were going for, for realism here. And it's so cool. It's so, so cool. Oh my god. 16 is gonna forever be my the game that I say is underrated. Forever and ever, amen, is gonna be the game I call one of the most underrated Final Fantasy games. It's so good. It's so good. The lore is something to bite your teeth into. Settings are beautiful. Boss fights are beautiful. The OST is bone-chilling. The Truly a stunning experience. Wow! Look at this place! It's like Fortnite! I'm eating this up with a spoon, dude! This is so cool! Rad scorpions! Oh! Hey! I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna sneak by you, my friend! Nope! <laughs> oh! I don't need to fight you, we don't need to fight! We can get along! <laughs> See? Oh, you're following me. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Oh, I don't have the Leviathan stuff. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Temple Curl, you would love the new raid in season on Mortal Kombat, dude. You would kill for that. How? Oh, my God. He climbs walls. It's because you're, you're a crazy person, huh? I'm telling y'all, the Bahamut... If y'all want my... If y'all want my my 16 strats the bahamut one if you're dealing with any kind of enemy is so good because the um the window for dodging is excellent there we go okay no okay time 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 strat 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 as fast as you can you can't strat me i'm the strat man Sorry, that was real cringe. N no one ever bring that up that I said that ever again. Because that was real cringe of me to ever say that. Oh my god! Get him! <laughs> Get him! <laughs> Hit that man with the with the with the with the with the lightning tower, the lightning rod, the satellite, the mega flare. Um, oh god, what's the other thing? What's the other thing? What's the other thing? What did I- what's the other thing? And the tornado, all at the same time, dude. I've not really deviated from my- my strategy in a long, long time. But I really want to try Leviathan. Leviathan! Oh, so there- look at this new- new little slot! Conjure a whirling wave of titanic proportions to swallow up and spit out all enemies caught in the surf. Golly gee. Missidia. 
<laughs> Y'all have no idea how like having played eight bit games now and seeing Missidia is like such a such a treat. Such a sweet treat that I am enjoying. Is this the same temple where that we were at yesterday? <laughs> is it the same temple where uh, we went with Aerith? What is it, Jillifer? I don't know. Come on, Jill. Don't start hiding things from me like Tifa does. Are you also Genova? Run! Run! Do the way they run! Do you see the way that they run? This is their, this is their little knife. Oh my good lord, that is too cute. Oh wait, 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 wait. New new ability, new ability. Get away from me. Oh, you know what this looks like? You know what this looks like? This reminds me a lot of um if you played Final Fantasy X, this reminds me a lot of Kilika, like the Kilika jungle behind the village. Um, like you're on your way up to the temple where they keep Ifrit. It's you. It's you. <laughs> you complete me. You complete me, Master Tonberry. You're more than welcome to us. Oh, oh, Christ alive. Oh my god, even you got a glow up, dude. You got such a glow up. I love it. I love your, like, blue skin, too. Although it would be really wild if, um, all of your attacks are insta-kills. Hey, hope not. Hey, let me not manifest that. Debone? What does that mean? Oh! Oh my god, keep away from him. Keep away from him. Farewell. Uh, 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 uh. This is how we do it. Ba -ba 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 -ba. It would have been so sick um, if they included like some sort of reference to Final Fantasy VII because I feel like if you're a Final Fantasy fan, it would make sense that you would go from Rebirth to, uh, this. Oh, shucks. Thank you, Defonaut. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, it would make sense you would go from Rebirth to this, you know what I mean? Since they're released really close together. So, it would be cool if, you know, there's a shout-out to the fans of both, uh, both games. Look at him. Look at him. What, what have they done to my boy? He looks like a he looks like one of the experiments from Lilo and Stitch. Oh, look, he paints his toenails. Aw, what have we done to this man? Yeah! Strike him down, Clive. Strike this sick monster down. I wish to wear his pelt on my wall, Clivefer. Get him, Clive! I need Clive to do the um I need Clive to do the Red Dead Redemption like Skinning animal animation. But it's what's out here that worries me. What does that mean? Hey, one of these. This looks like a boss stage. Tonberry King. Fafnir. Oh, hi. I was thinking they'd all migrated south. The weaker ones did. <laughs> the weaker ones did. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, yeah, you know what? This one might actually be really good if I want to keep my distance. Like, the, being able to dodge as much as you can with this? I don't know, dude. It's actually really good. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, whoa! <laughs> Kawabunga! Oh god, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh no, what are you doing though? What are you doing? Get ready for what? It up. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> no, don't do that again. Whoa! Before we cross the threshold, I'd like to know a little more about how these magics work. I assume we'll be safe from their influence. Good point. We won't grind to a halt, if that's what you mean. I just remembered that one scene in the Dungeons and Dragons movie where like everyone is frozen and they're like and then Hugh Grant's character is like oh. but if we can enter that means other things can as well that's typically how doors work is this Leviathan's doing 
This music is not what I imagined would be in here. I want to touch the frozen water. Oh my god. Like, I wonder if you touch one of these like, things that are frozen in time, do they like float off? It's like that scene in, I think it's X-Men, where Quicksilver like pauses like time and it's like, if time in a bottle, the first thing that I'd like to do. Like in that part, and like he would like move bullets around. I wonder if that, that's how this works as well. Oh my god, y'all. So far, like 110%, this DLC is way better than the Echoes of the Fallen. When we finish Echoes of the Fallen, I'm not gonna lie, I, I, I gave that bad boy like a 3 out of 10. It was not my favorite thing I've ever played. And so with this one, I am like in awe. I am like, I'm just, I'm really happy. I'm really happy. I really like, I like coming back to 16 and this is exactly like what I really loved about it. It's like when it's rich with lore, when it is, um, when it showcases such beauty, such beautiful settings and cinematography. Joshua, of course, of course, of course, I'm but a man. I thought it was like the lore of the Fallen was definitely interesting. I just wouldn't say it's like one of my favorite DLCs. I just felt like there was not enough in it. You know what I mean? I felt like it was there was not enough in it. I didn't like being inside of the um Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't like being inside of the tower the entire time. And I also wasn't really keen on um what's that called? I wasn't keen on the aesthetics of it because I felt like it was a little out of place. This game, I think it really thrives off of this kind of like fantasy, you know, like this old fantasy aesthetic. And so to me, it was just odd to be like in a place where like there are these synth waves, you know what I mean? Ooh, ooh, look at this fireball that's like frozen in midair. Oh my God. I don't know why anytime any of you guys say good luck, part of me gets like a real like in my stomach feeling or I'm like, oh, something something massive is about to happen. Does this ether not feel somehow? Familiar, yes. I sensed it the moment we arrived, though I wasn't sure until now. Familiar? You can feel it too, can't Sound you, Clive? She's calling us. Who? You don't mean the witch? I do. Though she was more than that. Much more. What does that mean? She was a dominant. A dominant who once... <gasps> oh! Oh! Which was Shiva! Sick. <laughs> Am I gonna fight Shiva? Oh, so this is the night thing. Hey. Hey. As if she shared it with another, just as Torgal shared in my eyes. <laughs> so, tell me about yourself. Pulls a heartless angel, takes me out immediately. She was companion. Though something tells me. Ah, so this is the witch's uh, Torgal. Take him out, take him out, quick! Whoa! Oh, I pressed the wrong button to dodge again! <laughs> Excuse me? Maybe I need to stay away from him. Maybe that's my strat here. Because he seems to struggle with ranged combat a lot. Whoa! He broke through my tornado! I want to see if there's somebody inside here. <laughs> Do you get those wings too? Sick. It's gonna get faster, isn't it? You're gonna get faster and stronger and smarter and sexier even. Oh my god. Whoa! I need to watch you for a sec. <laughs> Whoa! Zooey mama! Get him, get him, get him. Oh! Oh! No, run, Clive Eagle! Run! 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 Christ alive! 
Yeah, Bah Leviathan is so cool. And it's cool to know that he's like one of the like absolute OG summons. You know what I mean? Like, I think aside from Bahamut, he is the second oldest um summon. Because Bahamut was around for Final Fantasy 1, but it was Leviathan who was around for 2. Oh no. Oh no. Don't do it, don't do it, sir, please. <laughs> oh my god. Run, Clive! Run! Oh my god. <gasps> this man heartless angeled me. Oh my god, this man heartless angeled me. Oh no, I pressed the wrong button again. Uh, uh, I keep. Uh, it's my fault, it's my fault, it's my fault. I keep pressing circle to dodge, which I think was the, the button you had to press for in Rebirth. You're not even bothered by anything. Final oath! Please, no! Oh, Christ alive. You're angry, you're angry, you're angry, you're angry. I get it, I get it, I get it. I've been there. I've been there! I've been there! I wonder if I fought, um... I wonder if I fought Ultima with the Leviathan stuff, would I have to fight some, like, him with Leviathan's powers? Oh no! We took out the witch's Torgal. The thread connecting this place to the child should be broken. Meaning Walias should finally be- Freeze frame. Red marker. Free once more. Oh, you! Now, let the sins of man be redeemed. Yeah, Ultima! By the hand of the servant of God. Golly. <laughs> oh, it's like making whale sounds. That's kind of sick. This isn't over yet. Are we gonna ifrit it up? Say the thing, say the thing. The rest, the freight will handle. <laughs> sick. Sick o'clock. It's sick o'clock, y'all. It's sick o'clock. I wonder if things like this ever happen. Like a world, like a tornado, like, of water. I'm not here to hurt you, Wallius. And Wallius is such an interesting name. I wonder if it's like a true name as well. Oh no. Oh, run, Clive! Run, Clivey! Oh! Clive, now would be a great time for you to tra transform. Oh, I remember when Leviathan would speak in 15, and it was so cool. <gasps> look at his face! Never got a good look at his face in the trailers. He's like a shrimp. He has like a shrimp face. That's so cool. This isn't what I wanted. I only hope you can forgive me. What did we do wrong? We didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> He's like a giant shrimp, y'all. This is this is how I feel about going to Red Lobster. Me entering the the fine establishment of Red Lobster. Look at him. He's so sick. <laughs> Fun off water balloons. On, dude 16 boss fight music let's go sick ah! oh my god look at the teeth they're so shine like they're so small and spindly come on oh my god oh oh you're hard okay I can't I don't think I can dodge I don't gonna dodge oh this is gonna be like the um, Titan fight. I can't do <laughs> dodging in this thing is hard. I've not successfully dodged against something once. Oh shucks! Come on, go up, you fool! 
I know why I'm not dodging correctly. Because I keep pressing circle. Because I'm a fool. Because I'm a fool. I keep pressing circle because that's that's the dodge button in, in, um, in the thing. In rebirth. Oh my god. Grand fall. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh my god, I cannot believe. Oh, I'm a fool. I'm a fool. Cha -cha -cha -cha. Yeah! Look at me fighting a baby, you guys. Look at me fighting a baby. I'm about to I'm about to eat the dust here, folks. I'm about to eat the dust here. I'm out of I'm out of healing. Cause I'm silly. Ooh. Ooh. Great. I will not give up on you. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I took one hit and I died. Ah, oh, shucks. Leviathan. Hey, Leviathan? <laughs> Let me add him more like it. Where are you? Where are you, sick baby? Oh, you you missed because you're a baby and you're a loser. You're a loser, baby. Lesser babies have beaten me before, Leviathan. Lesser babies have beaten me before. Golly, I love this. Love the sky. I love the, love the feel of the wind in my hair. Water jet! Right. 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 I have you cornered now, baby! Watch me absolutely destroy, demolish this baby. Hey. Clive, you should know by now not to taunt them. Troubled waters! Oh. Get out here, baby. Get out here now! The sea rises in five. Oh god. Oh my 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 god. What? 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 Already? 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 No, I ran out of time. Heal up. Heal up. Heal up. Heal up. The village. Joshua, you better have gotten them to higher ground. Oh no. Tsunami! <laughs> Perhaps this is a fight we should have had Jillifer with us. I don't know. Or, hey, Joshua. No! Okay, 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 okay. I have a new strategy. If we boil Leviathan and serve him with rosemary and butter, do you think he'll be delicious? Oh, Leviathan paella would be s good choice. Good choice, Aymar. Because I, I have to imagine that Leviathan tastes like really good, you know what I mean? I have to imagine that Leviathan is actually really scrum -dilliumptious. There has to be like a stronger attack that I could have been using here. A Leviathan super fried Leviathan with sambal. Ooh. Bloom H is preparing a four co course meal for us. You know what I would make Leviathan in? I would cook him. I would cook Leviathan in like the um the lobster biscuits that Red Lobster makes. That's what I would do. I would like chop up Leviathan and put him in the lobster biscuit. No! <laughs> <laughs> he changed while I was doing the uh, Spitfire. If I could just get one more ability in here, it'll be over. Come on! Yeah! Oh, you child, you baby! Now it's time to destroy you. Yeah! Hear that? Hear the crowd roar at me beating, <laughs> beating the shit out of a baby. Yeah! Now this is the 16 music I know and love. Oh my god! 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 So much is happening. Oh no! It's over, baby. It's over. It's over. It's over. 
see a blue mage. No! Not this time. Whoa, what do you mean, not this time? What am I supposed to do, Clive? Can we hellfire this? Can we hellfire this? That's what you want. Controlled burn? <laughs> Why couldn't you do this earlier? Ah, so we roasted him. You've had your fun, Divine. <laughs> I'm gonna throw a neutron star at this baby. He's doing the Final Fantasy X Hellfire! <laughs> Whoa! Ifrit pulled, uh... Middle school dodgeball strats. Hey, now that's overkill. Hey, now that is overkill. We destroyed a child. We destroyed a newborn infant today at Mont Mont Games. Now this is what I've wanted to do the stream, make the streams about. It's fighting children. Now that was quite a tantrum. <laughs> oh, the eyes! Look. Oh, Clive with a baby. Hold on. Clive with a baby. Clive with a baby. Whoa. Wait. Clive holding a baby? Whoa. Kawabunga. Yo, Joshua! Joshua, hold this and let me take a picture. Joshua, hold the baby. He's adorable. Just hold the baby. Jill, I don't care. Joshua, hold the baby just so that I can take a quick picture. <laughs> Y'all hear, hear Joshua's little giggle? I don't know how to thank you. With money. True, you're right, Aymar. This baby does grow up to become Sephiroth. And so actually, what Clive did in sparing the baby was doom all of the worlds. All right, Missidia. I will be taking my payment in the form of Gil. Um, the tip screen is going to ask you a few questions. When the wounds in his heart and mind have finally healed, he might decide for himself how he'd like to live the rest of his life. Compelling point. I will take him. Thank you. Had Missidia revealed itself to Sid, like Sid Telemon, I could see him setting up the hideaway within the Haven. Hooray! That was a- that's a really short DLC. Hold on, I want to see what Aymar is saying is at the hideaway, and then we shall- we shall... Uh, skedaddle. A sinister light bleeds from the Arete Stone, beckoning Clive to enter. What does that mean? Is there like an extra challenge here? Oh no. Honey, I'm home. Muthos. Hey. You plumbed the very abyss, yet still you hunger. I like how you said hunger. Imagine, this is this is me fighting every single one of the icons. It's a 1v... 1v7? Oh, this thing from the trailer! What it's are these? Ours. And now, it is yours. Oh no. Consider it a gift. I would have rather new outfits. I want to try out the new power, Clive. Maybe we should just give it a go before we uh, reject it. I'll take your gift then, Ultima. Hey, attaboy. Ultimate power. Clive has been granted a portion of Ultima's essence, but allows access to several new divine abilities, such as voice of God. I get an Ultima icon. You hear me? Oh my God. <laughs> Proselytize? Oh lordy. <laughs> oh my lordy. Whoa, whoa. Oh, I just teleport like this? Oh, I cannot wait. I cannot wait to do a replay of this game now with this ability. 
Oh my god. That's interesting. They did some fan service. We bitched so many times in the game. We absorbed Ultima but didn't get his powers. All right, Final Fantasy 16 fandom. I need you all to email Square Enix and let them know we need a Joshua Rossfield Costa del Sol outfit. Please put him in swim trunks and sandals, please. All right, y'all. We finished it. There goes Rising Tide. I really, really loved this DLC. I really enjoyed it. Even though it was pretty short, um, such an enjoyable, enjoyable experience. So nice to come back and see um, what's going on over here. And like, uh, you know, Mysidia is so, so stunning. So well done. Loved seeing, you know, fighting Leviathan. That was really cool. The boss fights were really excellent. I would say the boss fights actually in the first DLC were a little were better, but vibes, cinematography, the just the, the look of it was so much better in this DLC. Also, I just thought it was much more enjoyable. I just really enjoyed this one a lot. So um, I'm excited to do this side quest on my own time. I'm excited to, um, to go through this on hard mode with my new abilities, with this Ultima ability. <laughs> I'm excited to try that out. Um, thank you, everybody, for joining me on it. I would give this thing a... I would give the DLC... Honestly, a pretty high rating. I would give it, as a DLC, an 8 out of 10. Kudos to the Rising Tide DLC. If you had to get one of them, I would say get the Rising Tide. Stop.